In today's WeatherWise segment, we're going to talk about the ratios. WeatherWise segment, where you take something complicated and make it easy to understand. Let's give you an easy definition of a deratio. What is it? It's a widespread, long-lived windstorm, usually with a fast-moving area of thunderstorms. They typically move between 40 and 50 miles per hour. It's all about the straight-line wind damage, all right? You can get isolated tornadoes, but it's mostly wind, and the wind damage has to be a continuous area where you have winds of at least 58 miles per hour for at least 400 miles in width uh, and uh, 60 miles, uh, 400 miles in length, 60 miles in width. That is what a deratio is. Now, what happened yesterday? First, take a look at high temperatures yesterday because what, how the ratios are usually formed, they're formed what I call thermally by a lot of heat and humidity and they usually occur on the northern edge of the heat and humidity. Well, look at the heat and humidity here building across the southeast, right across Indiana and Pennsylvania. Now, look where temperatures are in the 80s, look where in their 70s, all right? Watch where the ratio formed yesterday from the storm reports. There it is, starting in Indiana. And this is typically what you see as well. It fans out as it moves to the east-northeast before eventually weakening. Now, how long was this? Ari and I crunched the numbers here. It started in Martinsville, Indiana at 1138. It ended in Tunkhannock. I think that's in Wyoming County in Pennsylvania. So it was well over 500 miles. And when you look at historically, when did the ratios usually start to occur? They usually begin in May, June and July. And here we are in late April. And now you know. AccuWeather Early continues after this.